one, an interception just beyond the 40-yard line. Interception, Duke, Jeremiah Lewis has it for the Blue Devils. I've been playing football, God knows how long, first grade. Um, it's just something that we've, I guess, always done in Texas. Um, I, I began playing at a little age just to, you know, be active. Man, as time, you know, went on, I really grew a passion for the game and a love for the game. I knew I wanted to, to be at a place where my, where my parents didn't have to pay for school. Late middle school, early high school is kind of when I made that decision. And then that's kind of when I kind of took my game to a whole other level. Let's talk about going to Duke. Uh, why'd you choose that? Duke, um, so happened to be my first uh, Power Five offer. I wanted to be, you know, in the best situation, play against the best athletes, the best competition. Duke kind of gave me that opportunity, believed in me um, from an early age, was always, you know, trusted them and, and what they could, you know, possibly do for me and what I could do for them. Back, off inside the five, it's lit up at the one. 2020, Seems like you're a full-time starter, 827 snaps. And then it goes back down to 576. Now, after that fourth season at Duke, you transferred. Would you attribute that to the less amount of snaps that you wanted more playing time over at Northwestern? No, the, so the biggest reason for me transferring is I wanted to transition positions. When I got to Duke, I played corner. You know, they felt like I could get on the field early playing corner, so I just kind of took it and ran with it. Um, did well, chief well, but my, my biggest was obviously wanted to transition to safety, which is what I played primarily in high school. Um, just given my, my, my skill set, my IQ, uh, my instincts. This time for Allen. Lost the football! Exactly what Northwestern needed! You had a little bit of time over at Northwestern, so what made you go back? Was there a safety position that opened up at Duke? Yeah, so Duke, Duke wanted me back. I mean, at Northwestern, I played free safety, so I played a lot on the back end high post stuff like that and and a, a dude that you know asked me to do a different role uh which is be more of a run fitter in the box more, much more closer to the line of scrimmage um that i think allowed me to show off my physicality show off that i can cover wide variety of space being at northwestern playing more deeper high post um reading qb vision where Duke was kind of like, we need you to, you know, come stop the run. Which of those two would you prefer and which one do you feel like you, you best uh, succeed at so that you can have longevity in the NFL? I mean, I think I succeeded at both. I think a lot of people, you know, you would think as far as longevity, it's like least body injuries. But I mean, I, I really adapted to the willingness to tackle. I don't think there's a one size fit all. So I, I think that's just a test to like my skill set and my versatility that I've kind of um, adapted these last couple of years. Watch it hit again, and it sails, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Duke's Jeremiah Lewis. Why do you believe that Jeremiah Lewis should be a starting safety in the NFL? I think what I did this last year is unheard of. Transfer somewhere else three days after in August. Ended up playing, starting, played multiple positions. And you don't hear about how people learn a whole playbook in three to five days. That's just unheard of. I don't think there's any or many or any safeties that's, that's able to do that. I can't probably count any times where uh, a ball carrier is you know, run and, and I fall back. I mean, I believe that as far as fluidity, I don't think there's any other safety or defensive back that's as fluid as me. That's why I'm, I'm more than deserving and more than able to, to start and, and play in this league.